what is up guys Brandon here and today I am back with another Minecraft Pocket Edition video and today you guys today I have something really special for you guys uh, this is going to be a server review but this is actually something that I did a little while ago actually about a year ago and um, yeah so um, this is going to be a server review for the SBS server now if you guys do remember I did this about a year ago Landy reminded me um, it was like a year and seven days ago. I don't know. He told me the exact date of when I did it. But anyways, uh, they've done a lot since then. And um, yeah, I'm going to be reviewing that. So let's first get started on talking about what they've added. So originally, SBS was a modern server. They had uh, a modern world that was fairly large, maybe about, I don't know. I don't know how large it was originally, but they have added so much more to that. And in addition, they've added actually three more warps. So now I'm going to be splitting this video into two parts. The first part will just be reviewing the modern part, and the other will be reviewing the fantasy warp, as well as the two little um, plot build warps. So the plot build warps are for potential builders, people who want to join but aren't in the team yet. And then the uh, fantasy and modern uh, warps are for the people who are in the team and accepted. So uh, yeah, over here, out this window, we have the little Illuminati symbol that Landy wanted me to show. Oh, uh, out here we have this nice little garden, which I actually really like. Plus, uh, with this texture pack, the leaves are moving, so uh, let me just zoom in, and there you go. You can just see as it moves with the wind. So for those of you guys who are wondering what exactly the texture, this texture pack is, this is a um, this is Flows HD, as well as it is combined with a shaders pack, as well as Wavy World, so that the leaves and grass move. So uh, if you guys do want this texture pack, the download will be in the description below. And uh, yeah, so on this side is the um, SBS logo, and that's all there really is for this little spawn. So for over here, you can just pick up the four warps. Those are the two plot worlds, the fantasy world is on the right. And over here is where we want to go. This is SBS City, or the modern world. So I'm just going to wait for my chunks to load, because they do take just a little while. Here we go. Okay, so this is the world. You guys might remember this from the last video if you guys watched it, but... Uh, SBS, the server is managed by Landy, so he is the owner, and he is a longtime friend. So, uh, all rights to this server goes to the server itself. At, oh my god, who, what are you doing? What, where did you TP me to? What the, where did you TP me to? Alrighty, and we're back. Sorry about that, some guy had no clue who I was and decided to TP me to where he was, which was kind of annoying. Anyways. So where was I? Uh, the server was managed by Landy, so all rights to this server goes to the server itself, and at sb underscore server is the official Twitter page, so I'll have that in the description below for you guys to check out. So this is the official server of the retired MSS clan, so that's actually, that takes me back because I actually was the co-founder of the MSS clan, along with Landy, and uh, we founded it, it was our build clan way back in the day when I used to build, but um, there was a little dispute that ended up with the clan splitting, Landy going one way and me going the other way. Landy ended up forming SBS, and I joined Elite Builds. So if you want to build on this server, then you'll have to ask them on their Twitter, because you will have to apply. And uh, yeah, so here are all the names and staff, so I'll just, if you guys want to see that, just pause the video. Uh, I do know some of them, such as Landy, uh, StickyMC, Donatron, Powerbang, uh, Geoman, Olympus, those guys. But um, yeah, so anyways, this spawn is actually pretty cool. Uh, over here we have a little... Uh, like Starbucks almost, you know, coffee, snacks, uh, you can get Frosties, things like that, like ice cream. Uh, and then over here, you have a nice little garden out this side with trees and things like that. And then out on the front, there's actually something pretty cool. So I'm just going to walk over there. Hurry up. Oh wait, I keep on forgetting that they're sprinting now. Anyways, so down here is a bus stop. So, you know, you just kind of wait over here. The bus comes down. You can hop in. It's, it's pretty cool. I like it. I like the design that they had. And then if we just walk right back up, there are a lot of signs. Oh, I don't even know what that is. I think that's talking about their buildings and stuff like that. And then you walk right out here, and here is the world. So uh, right out here is the road. It goes either direction. So I'm just going to hide my GUI, fly up over here, make sure I have the up and down control set, and then I'm going to start uh, doing a little, um, what's this called? I forget what it's called, but I'm just going to be recording and I'm going to be playing music. So, hope you guys do enjoy, and uh, I'll see you at the end. Uh, peace out. Thank you. 
Alrighty guys, so that was the end of the tour, so I hope you guys did enjoy that little uh, modern world. It did have some modern, traditional, and Victorian style of building, so I definitely think they melded well, and I can't wait to see more of what they build because they are still continually expanding. I don't know if you guys saw, but all throughout the world there were plots of things or unfinished buildings, so they still have yet to do those things, and they can add even more to this. Now, in addition, there are a few houses that I really, really love, so I'm thinking of reviewing those individually, you know, checking out the furnishings, things like that, because I didn't do that in this video because it would have made it too long if I checked out each house individually. It would have easily been a two-hour video if I did that, and one, I know that neither I or you guys have the patience for that. So, um, if you guys do want to see that as a separate series, then definitely let me know down in the comments section down below, and uh, yeah. That's basically about it, so if you guys did enjoy, as always, make sure to drop a like down below, and if you haven't subscribed already, then make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.